Well, this is what we're going to be cooking today. These beautiful chicken, bacon and leek pies. Come on, let's get cooking. Right, these are the ingredients we're going to be using today. Some bacon, leek, chicken, onion, puff pastry. Um, there's going to be some... Uh, milk in the roux and some butter as well um, some Dijon mustard and some ground black pepper this will be a very very straightforward simple and delicious chicken pie for New Year's right let's get cooking right we'll start with our bacon firstly whenever I buy bacon I take it out of its plastic container put it into my container that I put in the fridge and I take the use by date and I cut this out and put it on the top so I know where I'm at with it. I'm going to take around about 150 grams of this, fry it off and then put it in that bowl and then we'll come and back and do the chicken. Right and that's our bacon. Fry it off. Now, in with our chicken. Looks like it gets sorted. <laughs> oh, dear. Now, take two, in with our chicken. See a lot of chicken there too. Not a poultry amount. Right. I'll just get it on then. And there you have it, our chicken all cooked, now it's time for our roux. So now we're going to make our roux, I've got 40 grams of butter and then we'll chop up one onion and get that underway. Now first we melt the butter to 2000 degrees centigrade or until the bottom of the pan just about falls out or just like that really. Now we're going to chop up the onion. There you are, there's the onions all chopped up. I didn't film me uh, chopping them because I'm, I'm a bit rubbish at chopping onions. I've tried and tried and tried. I've watched Gordon Ramsay chop onions. I've watched Gordon Ramsay's wife chop onions. Actually, I just started watching Gordon Ramsay's wife after that. Right, um, let's... Uh, Let's get some flour in here, shall we, after these have softened. Right, cut your leeks like this in half. And then hold the bottom part like this. And as you can see, it allows you to pull these back and wash them. Then you can start chopping them. There you go, there's the leeks all chopped up. I'm just going to put them in the pan with a knob of butter and sweat them down before I add to the roux. Right, let's get our flour into this roux. This is just the softened onions and the butter. And we want to cook that through for around about two to three minutes. I'll come back in two to three minutes. And while I was um, away, I put a crumbled chicken stock cube in there too, just while you weren't looking. Right, now that that's cooked down, in with 250 mils of milk. And we're just going to stir that through until we get a really, really thick sauce there. Alright, that's nice and thick now. So let's go in with our chicken and our bacon. Stir those through. See how nice and thick that is. And let's add our leeks. Stir that through. And now we're going to have a bit of a taste before we add our black pepper. Have a little go in there. 
Mmm, that is super yummy. Let's get some black pepper on those. <laughs> Always tastes better a roux with some black pepper in there. That's very thick. We're going to leave this to cool now. Once I've um, Mm. Oh wow. Right, I'm gonna let it cool. Then we're gonna get a pastry together and get these pies in the oven. Right, it's a humid day today, so we're not gonna muck around here. Um, about a centimetre wider than the dish that you're making the pie in. Then once you've cut it, see how that's a little bit shiny, just pop a little bit of flour. Just to soak up that moisture and to make sure it doesn't stick to the bottom of your pie dish. And then use your knuckles. My fingernails are quite short but as you can see, but um, if you've got long fingernails, <laughs> they'll just puncture the um, pastry and you don't want that. So there you go, that's ready to put the filling in. I'll do the other two uh, and then we'll fill them and put the tops on. Right, they're all done now, so we're just going to put our filling into our pies. Don't overfill them otherwise they will squirt out the sides. So just level with the top. Right and we'll do the rest. Right, to finish these off we'll put the lids on. All we do is put a bit of egg wash around the outside like that. Then we get our tops, put them on. Like that. And then go around like this and crimp them. Then you can trim the edges like that. And that's ready to go into the oven at 180 degrees for about 24 minutes I would say, about 24 minutes. Firstly though we're going to pop a few holes in the top to let it vent and we're going to egg wash the top so that they come out nice and golden. And that's all there is to it really, lovely New Year's Eve pie. <laughs> you don't you didn't think I was going to go before giving you a look at them coming out of the oven and tasting them did you? Right I'm going to put these in the oven and then I'll come back for the tasting. As you can see a couple of those have spilled out because of overfilling. Let's get one of these out for a taste shall we? Right let's have a little <laughs> I was going to say that the first tasting but as you can see I've already been into this so let's have a a little bit more mm. oh that's divine well I can't say <laughs> 
enough about these they're absolutely beautiful that flaking of, of the pastry and the filling with the leeks and the bacon and the chicken just beautiful I hope you try this at home and I will catch you on the next recipe